WWE Armageddon continues on in what has been an absolutely amazing WWE Mega Premium Live event here. We have the Hug and Boss Connection set to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with the Queens, Miss Money in the Bank, and the WWE Women's Champion, Charlotte Flair, Shayna Baszler. We just got done seeing a dream match between Bill Goldberg and Minoru Suzuki that ended both guys with a face full of blood. And I think the fans are clamoring to see more. Do you guys want to see Suzuki Goldberg Part 3? Part 1 was on ECW. Part 2 here on Armageddon. How about a Part 3? You guys want to see it. That was crazy. Here comes your Money in the Bank briefcase holder as we are approaching WrestleMania season. And Charlotte Flair, as you guys remember, she won Money in the Bank and vowed that she was not going to cash in her Money in the Bank briefcase until WrestleMania. She wanted to skip the Royal Rumble. She wanted to skip any Elimination Chambers. Well, her best friend now holds the Women's Championship. And that's been the speculation, but Charlotte says, I'm not cashing in on my best friend. It's WrestleMania. If it happens at WrestleMania, it happens at WrestleMania. But Shayna Baszler, who been a pretty dominant WWE Women's Champion. In fact, eliminating all of her top contenders leading up to this, meaning she didn't have to defend her title tonight. And she actually avoided a Women's Championship match because Charlotte Flair, her best friend, defeated Carmella, which uh, pretty much wiped out that championship opportunity. But we're going to see what goes down in this match here. Always a chance. Sasha Banks or, or Bayley you get a win, you get an opportunity at the Women's Champ, and with the Royal Rumble coming up next month in Universe Mode, getting a win in this matchup and then possibly turning that into a Women's Championship opportunity coming up at the Royal Rumble, that means you get to skip the entire 30-woman Royal Rumble. You get to skip the Rumble, you get a one-on-one -on -one shot with the champ, and then you can head to WrestleMania. So this is the easiest path right now for Bailey or Sasha Banks. Instead of going through 29 other fighters in the Rumble, you win this tag match, you pin the champ, you get them at the Rumble, you go to WrestleMania. So we got Shayna Baszler and Bailey on the outside of the ring. Inside the ring, Charlotte Flair and the boss, Sasha Banks, going toe to toe. Look at Bailey, my God. Who's Bailey doing some MMA training there? Is that an MMA move? Putting uh, Shayna Baszler down the back. Oh, oh! She bounced off the steel ring steps. We still have coming up on this card here, we have our WWE Tag Team Championship match coming up, but that one's gonna be a little different because one half of the Tag Team Champions missing in action did not show up tonight. Kevin Owens calling in some favors. We are going to have a tag team title match tonight. And we are going to crown new tag team champions. We also have the ECW championship on the line. The Iron Man match between CM Punk, Braun Breaker, and Kofi Kingston. That is still to come in this broadcast. And our main event. Stadium Stampede, a 16-person Stadium Stampede match between the Judgment Day and Retribution. Eli, Dan, I hope you're ready for it because it is going down right now. Stadium Stampede on the horizon. But for right now, it's Shayna and Charlotte versus Hug and Boss Connection here. And Bailey picking up Baszler. Bailey doing a nice job with Shayna Baszler here. Sasha Banks going after the Money in the Bank briefcase holder from Charlotte Flair. A lot of interesting scenarios that are going to play out as we head into the WrestleMania season. With the Royal Rumble on the horizon, the Money in the Bank in the hands of Charlotte Flair. Bailey crushing Shayna Baszler. Here's a cover. And the referee could not, I mean, he could not get in position at all. And Bailey, look at this. Bailey 
hitting Charlotte with her own natural selection. Oh, and only a two count now. I don't, you know, if you pin Charlotte, is that going to mean the same as pinning the WWE Women's Champion? I don't know. That's something that uh, we'll have to see play out. There's a leg sweep by Charlotte Flair onto Bailey. And Baszler and Banks on the outside of the ring into the steel steps. Two title matches and stadium stampede still to come later tonight. And what's been one of the craziest nights. And we've had some crazy pay-per-view mega events, I call them here, in universe mode. We've had some crazy ones, including last month at Survivor Series when we crowned a brand new owner of WWE and Kevin Owens. This is Kevin Owens' first show. This has been absolutely insane. Submission locked in in the ring by Charlotte Flair. And now Bailey got Charlotte and drops her on the back of her head. Bailey coming into this one with an intensity. I think Sasha just went all the way around the ring just to. Wait a minute, we got a cover. And a kick out by Charlotte Flair, count of two. So what do you guys think? What do you think of the uh, the job? What is Kevin Owens in his first month? The job that he has done, right? What do you guys think? Dan says he's doing good, right? What about you, Eli? How, how you liking the, the Kevin Owens era thus far? Charlotte Flair working over. Bailey and now a figure eight about to be locked in. Sasha Banks might want to look to try to break this one up here. Figure eight is in, and that might. Let's see, can Bailey hang on? No, Sasha Banks. We won't know. But she comes over and breaks that one up. Cover by Charlotte. And two count. Kick out by Bailey. Big boot. Which is uh, which is usually setting up here for a natural selection or something. Oh, look at that, Shayna Baszler. Oh, Carafuda clutch, locked in on to the boss. Bailey though breaks it up. What was Charlotte Flair? Just kind of a little lax of days there. What do you guys think about that? That was interesting. Here's your uh, cover by Charlotte and broken up by Bailey. Another figure eight with Charlotte throwing everything out there right now. The queen between the care food of clutch and the figure eight and is, is Sasha gonna be able to hang on here? I, Bailey broke that one up. Forearm shot by Bailey rocking Shayna Baszler. And a clothesline onto the WWE Women's Champion in the corner here. Cover by Charlotte Flair. Oh, that was a three count. So the Queens get the win. Charlotte and Shayna Baszler remain dominant here in universe mode. Interesting, we didn't get a replay here. I don't know if we're gonna cut scene or something universe mode style or what, but at least two seem like they're uh, continue to be on the same page. This money in the bank in the WWE Women's Champion. All right, guys, coming up next, it is our WWE Tag Team Championship match. We know the Usos are here, but. Well, we got one member of the Heyman Empire missing in action, not showing up to the building tonight. And from what we understood, what we, like we said, uh, several favors were made, several, several call-ins were made to get this championship match to take place here on this broadcast. It's going to happen, and we're going to crown brand new 
WWE Tag Team Championships champions here in this broadcast here tonight. So don't forget, there's all the ways you can support TB Sports. Of course, our Patreon shout-outs. Thank you guys so much for your support. As always, Dan is always a regular joiner here in the chat on Twitch. But here come the Usos. And boy, these, uh, these tag team titles, they have definitely found some new homes over the last number of months in universe mode from the Usos winning them from the longtime champions of Baron Corbin and Madcap Moss. And then you saw CM Punk and Kevin Owens with a Rain Edge and Rey Mysterio as well. And you turn that over to the last reign that we had recently between Roman Reigns and Brock Lesnar as part of the Heyman Empire. But... Well, there is a, there's no Lesnar anymore. Lesnar's not here. He didn't show up. He's, uh, I don't know what he's dealing with in his personal life, but look at this. Ladies and gentlemen, look who's got the WWE Tag Team Gold with him. We've heard speculation. We heard John Cena's name. We heard Stone Cold Steve Austin, who was in the shield with Roman Reigns in a previous universe mode. But who else, on a moment's notice, has the kind of money to and jump on a flight, first, a private jet, and get Golden here Brothers, within an hour? In Roman Reigns had to look to his bloodline. He is one half of the WWE and The Rock is going to defend the WWE Tag Team Championship with Roman Reigns. This is unbelievable. The Rock. What else are we going to see at Armageddon tonight? What else is going to happen on this card? We still have Stadium Stampede to come tonight. Is The Rock now a, a WWE Tag Team Champion? Is this official? The Rock and Roman Reigns? The Bloodline? Oh my God, you guys. What a replacement. What a replacement that, that they got for this matchup. And there he is. There's cousin Roman Reigns. We're going to see The Rock and Roman Reigns team up for the first time ever. Completely unannounced. And take on the Usos. This is all family in this matchup. From Pensacola, Florida, weighing in at 265 pounds. He is one half of the WWE Tag Team I, I honestly can't believe what we're seeing right now. Reigns heads towards the ring and the WWE Tag Team Championship match about to get underway. The Usos versus The Rock and Roman Reigns for the WWE Tag Team Championship. There's the Usos. There's the uh, there's the champs. The new champ. I guess they're officially the champs, huh? Is it official? I wish I knew, Dan. I don't know what's happening anymore. We said we were going to crown new champions tonight. Well, either way, here we go. Rock, Roman, Usos at Armageddon. Now, is Rock full-time? Now, like we said, in a previous universe mode, The Rock owned WWE. That was back when we had WWE, WCW, and ECW as three separate brands. Rock owned... Oh, a spine buster onto The Rock. Rock owned... Um, and again, I, I guess I should go without saying, I, I buried the lead because we were talking so much about 
the rock and everything. This is a two out of three falls matchup, by the way. This was the stipulation, so I, I didn't mention it. You see the numbers there. Two out of three falls in this one. But the rock previously for a year owned WWE Raw, but he had to sell it back, and he had to sell it back to its previous owners, and he had to step away, go to Hollywood a couple of times. He had some of his friends like Ron Simmons and Batista step in to run the show for a while, but ultimately it, uh, it was actually a situation with Brock Lesnar, to be quite honest, that led to The Rock having to sell WWE back to its previous owners, and now Kevin Owens in charge of WWE is the rock back or is this just a, a, a stepping in for the time being like we said we had heard rumors I didn't want to report on them without them being official but we had heard you know John Cena being a possibility of someone that Roman Reigns was maybe trying to get a hold of we, we heard Stone Cold Steve Austin's name as someone you know there's even speculation about Bill Goldberg but then the dream match like obviously you saw the condition of Bill Goldberg there's no way he could have had that match with Suzuki and then had this match up here. Uh, Steve Austin was someone. We, we even heard John Moxley's name. John Moxley not even under contract to WWE. We heard his name thrown around. We heard maybe Seth Rollins pulling double duty. First pinfall. That was nearly, but it's going to be The Rock that shows up. And The Rock and Roman Reigns. A new bloodline here in WWE. Rock. Belly to belly. There's the cover. Is that? I think that's. Uh, we've got Jay Jay Uso there. Jimmy Uso. Jay's got the cross, right? Rock stomping away at Jimmy Uso. Got Jay to the top, diving headbutt here. What else is going to happen in Armageddon? We have the ECW Championship Iron Man coming up next. And then our main event, Stadium Stampede, still to come, guys. Rock. Classic Rock. Cover. Roman. Kicks out. Two out of three falls for the WWE Tag Team Championship. Rock. DDT. Flying Uso. Rock. Breaks that one up. Rock's got Jay. Oh. Busting out the knee of Jay Uso. Look at the Rock getting fired up here at Armageddon. Rock. Oh, wait a minute. Rock bottom. A rock bottom on to Jay Uso. Oh, but Roman's got the submission referee. Cover. Oh, and Jay Uso kicks out. Referee. Oh, Rock. Make sure the referee gets a, gets a, you know, gets a taste of that. Spine buster by Jimmy Uso on to Roman Reigns. A, a family affair in this one. Two count. And the Rock comes flying in. Rock looks great. Neck break around to the Rock. Big splash from Jimmy Uso. Referee just... Well, he, he's got a handful of, of tights, I think, and he just pinned Roman Reigns. So it's two out of three falls here. And Roman, though, fighting out. Belly to belly by the Rock, Roman. I thought he was, oh, oh, I thought he was gonna go for a Samoan drop right there. Rock. Oh, there's a submission by Roman Reigns. Is that tap out? Yeah, is that yes? Yes, it is. So we go to a third fall in the two out of three falls matchup. Next fall wins it. Next fall, your WWE Tag Team Champion. Super kick by Jimmy, or by Jey Uso, rather. Rock, duck under, DDT.
Uso. Jimmy Uso to the top on the rock. Uso splash and he nails it on the People's Champ. New champions. No, the rock kicks out. Cover on to Roman Reigns. Rope break. Next fall wins it. Two out of three falls. Usos versus The Rock and Roman Reigns here at Armageddon. Uso splash. That might do it for Roman Reigns. Cover. New champions. Yes, the Usos are once again WWE Tag Team Champions. Oh my God, The Rock came in to defend the titles with Roman Reigns. Look at this, the Usos, they seem very upset about this situation here. And they're going after Roman Reigns. They're going after Cousin Roman Reigns. Look at the Usos. They do not, at, Roman Reigns just bailed out of the ring. Oh, I think we have an invisible wrestler. I think that's the, I think he got thrown out of the ring. Guys, the Usos are not happy. They are ticked off about this whole situation. Coming up next, the ECW Championship is on the line. Iron Man match. And then it's Stadium Stampede.